So today I'm going to be showing you how to plant up these two beautiful winter hanging baskets. I'm showing the second one. Only containing three plants. Very simple and easy to put together and I'm going to talk you through those now. So I'm going to talk you through how I'm going to plant up these winter hanging baskets. So I've got violas in various shades, a cyclamen and some ivy as well. That's all the plants I'm going to include in this winter hanging basket. Very simple, dead easy, just to bring a bit of colour to the garden over winter. So I've got two baskets here. I'm going to be planting one up as a nice ball of um, violas in mixed colours just for a bit of colour on the fence. And I've got one with a cyclamen and I'm going to put some ivy in it as well. So it's a nice standalone basket, a bit of impact with the pink and white cyclamen. These are all winter flowering, so the ivy will grow quite nicely and the leaves will show through. Nice trailing plant, grow quite happily anywhere and that'll be really good for the winter. The cyclamen is an autumn winter flowering plant as well and it will keep coming back, it's a perennial, it's a corn, so it will keep coming back each year. But I will, as soon as the baskets go over, the violas go over sort of mid-spring, early summer, um, when I'm getting ready to plant up my summer hanging baskets, I will take them out and pot them up and then reuse them next year. So I just put them, keep them in the pot all year and then um, when I come to do my autumn winter baskets next year, I'll replant it. Very easy. So, I'm going to be doing the violas and some ivy in the big basket and the cyclamen and some ivy in the small basket. So, I'm going to show you what I'm doing. So, very simple. I've just filled it with some uh, multi-purpose compost. Just standard multi-purpose. doesn't have to be anything too special for baskets in the winter. They don't need feeding too much and they don't need um, any water storing crystals to help them with the moisture. Um, because you get more moisture in the in the winter anyway than you do the summer. They need less help. They don't need the extra food either, so they don't need extra feeding because, generally speaking, plants slow down their growth in the winter, so you don't have to worry about feeding them too much. And besides watering them every now and then to keep an eye on them, because they are a basket, which works for containers as well, they do dry out quicker than they would do in the ground, um, they will not use up so much moisture either. So you won't have to worry about too much maintenance involved in them at all. So, violas in the big pot. Place these around first. I'll show you. So we're just gonna use a few in here because they will spread out quite nicely and fill the pot, or fill the basket. Change always funny on these ones. They don't come off the edge, so um, they kind of just have to move around with the plants. Three. Put them there. Three, and then I'm going to use three whites. So if you just place the bottom of the tray, they come out nicely then, and then just lift them out gently by the roots. One. I'm trying to alternate the colours to make it look a bit nicer. There we go, so we've got white, blue, white, blue, white, blue. Well, not blue, but yeah. Now, as you can see, I don't know if you can see on these, they have got a few dead heads already. These are really good plants, actually. I've got some good ones from the nursery. I didn't grow these myself. I normally would do. But if you can, remove the dead heads to encourage more flowers to come through. So I'll just go through and deadhead these quick. Here we go. And down there. Right. So these are just around the edge. So I'm just going to um, fill in around them and then put some ivy in between the plants and then that will be that basket done. So simple and yet so effective. So 
So I'm just going to feed the ivy through the edge on the liner, through the edge so it trails under the top rim of the basket and it'll just hang over the edge then quite nicely. Right. So that's that basket done and now I'm going to move on to the cyclamen and ivy basket ready for the next one. Right, so this basket's going to be really simple. I've got the one cyclamen and some ivy in the sides. It's really easy. I'll reuse the cyclamen each year and I'll repot the ivy as well. So when autumn winter comes round again, I can just simply use the, the plants all over again. They're all perennial, they're quite happy and they love the winter. So quite good. So I just put this, the cyclamen's going to be the centerpiece, fill up most of the pot and it will keep flowering well into the winter, into the mid spring really. The ivy will keep growing so I'm just going to put that through into the pot and in a minute I'll cover it with compost so then they'll trail nicely down over the edge. Now you can buy ivy in pots in the garden centres or nurseries as well. Um, florists usually have it as well so you can buy them for your hanging baskets if you haven't got any growing in the garden but I've got some growing so I use that much easier. Right let me now fill in around. Squish them down so it beds them in nicely and in a minute I will water them in. I hang them on the um, fence and then I water them in nicely and then if you can see as they grow we'll have a trailing ivy all the way around and you have the citrum in the middle. So that'll have a really nice bit of winter colour ready to go. And again, so easy, so simple. There's two plants involved in that. And they can be reused year after year, so you're saving yourself money once you invest in them once. I just lift the cyclamen out the basket the, when I reuse the basket for the spring-summer displays. I just um, pop the cyclamen up and then have it ready. I sit in the greenhouse in the bottom of the garden in the shade. I'll just have it ready, grow in there, ready for the next time I want to plant up an autumn winter hanging basket. So easy. Cyclamen that we just planted up, really nice impact basket. And then I've got my viola basket here, which will fill out. I've only got a few plants in there, six plants in there um, with some ivy, but that'll fill out really full. They'll grow and fill the space. So they'll be quite good. And it's about three quid for a tray of six plants. It's nothing. And these will die off again for the spring summer. And then I can just empty the basket out and regrow it. Perfect. So I'm going to go water these now and then hang them on the fence. Ready to go. <laughs> If you like this video give us a thumbs up if you'd like to subscribe to the channel click here and if you would like to catch the next video in the run click here thank you for watching and i'll see you all in the next one see you later